Welcome everybody to Food Reviews in... Bed! Because <laughs> everybody knows this is the best place to eat snacks, goodies, all that stuff when you got kids who eat it faster than you do, right? <laughs> Today we're going to get to the bottom of a mystery. At least it was a mystery for us, right? Keto ice cream. <laughs> Keto ice cream, you hear it? <laughs> uh, I've never heard of this stuff before. Uh-oh, I'm covering your face. There we go. Hold yours up there, hon. <laughs> Actually, so, you have my flavor. I have your flavor. <laughs> oh, whoops. So, uh, yeah, we never, like, we're not into, like, a keto diet or anything. But this is kind of, like, out there a lot right now. And... Well, I don't know. Personally, I was just kind of hoping it tasted like regular ice cream. I don't know. Were you, what were you hoping to get out of this? I don't know. I just saw it. It was something new and thought, hey, why not review it? You're not curious? No, I got to have a better reason than that. Well, I like ice cream. <laughs> Is keto healthier? Maybe Supposedly, yeah. There's no added sugar. They got monk fruit in here to sweeten it. Well. Monk you know, fruit if... extract. If a fruit could study in the Himalayas and learn all that wisdom, surely they could sweeten ice cream, right? Okay, sorry. <laughs> Let's just open this up. We, uh, we have a varying of opinions on this. She likes to go with a cone, and I think those just get in the way. Plus, you only get like a little baby scoop then. So, I like to eat twice as much right out of the thing. Oh, it says, for the best texture, let the ice cream thaw. Well, we kind of let it thaw a little bit, right? A little bit, maybe. Well, I don't know how long they want you to let it thaw for. So you got to make a cone anyway, so that'll give you a couple minutes. Uh, yeah, I see what they mean, probably, because it does... It almost looks freezer burnt. Yeah. But that could be the store <laughs> that we got it at has been known to sometimes have freezer burnt. Yeah, we live in one of those towns. It's a one grocery store town. And if anybody knows what that's like, uh, they can get away with a lot more stuff because you need them. <laughs> so, uh, well, they've actually gotten a lot better because the dollar, the dollar store is in town now. And when I say dollar store, I mean dollar general. I, I, I meant to right, specify right. that earlier, but. We're not sponsored by either one of them. So. No. <laughs> Oh, we did, did we even tell them the flavors? All right, um, I got peanut butter fudge swirl. I'm going to see if this tastes like regular ice cream or what. And I got mint chip. All right, spoons up. Yours spooned a lot better than mine. I'm not going to be able to get this in a cone. Whoa. Okay, so I'm definitely noticing a different texture right away. It's almost... Fluffier. What? Well, if you like shave it off, like I kind of shaved it off the top a little bit. So you get like a thinner bite. Oh, I got some fudge in this one. You like it? It reminds me of something. It's not horrible. It's intriguing. Mm -hmm. Because it's got a, a different texture. I did get, it was like almost velvety or like. Yeah, like snow or something, kind of. No. Not snow. Maybe like real thick snow. Yeah, like when you pack it. When you pack like a real firm snowball and then you go to take a bite out of it. When it's the real fine stuff. My memory is not as good as yours. Well, I do it every year, so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Uh, but I kind of like, like you can see, the texture looks creamy. It is, it's creamier than I thought it was going to be. I thought you were making a comb. <laughs> I, I, look at this. Okay, so I'm trying to get ice cream out of here. 
Do you know how long? No, 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 no. You're, you're not using simple machines, man. You gotta treat that spoon like a lever and a wedge, man. Yeah, cause see, you got that. You got the fulcrum right there at the bottom of the hump. That's your fulcrum, man. So you gotta <laughs> poke that tip in there, and then crank on it a little bit. Too much info in bed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Sorry. Um, but no, this is pretty. Here, try this one. I'm telling you, it's not as bad as you think it might be. Mm. She made a yummy face and a yummy noise. <laughs> it is good. Isn't it? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think I like your... This always yeah. happens. See, whenever we go anywhere, <laughs> whenever we pick out anything, she picks something totally lame. And I'm like, you're going to want mine, I'm telling you right now. <laughs> And like she's like, no, I think I like it. And I don't know, maybe she just wants to be different, or maybe get two things so we can try two things. That right? Could be. Yeah, I wanted us each to have a flavor. No, but it's, it's all the time. That's true. Oh. You want to take a bite mm. of this one? No, hold on. My uh, too many flavors in your mouth. My palate is all peanut buttery. All right. I didn't taste any peanut butter in here. Hit yours. me, baby. Wow. It's good. I like how it's not too minty. Right. Yeah. Same it's, thing it's with a... with this one. It's like a real light peanut butter flavor. It's not in your face. I didn't even really taste peanut butter. Hey, did you get any of the chocolate? Mm-mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> I know you. Whoa. Yeah. So is this one better? But yeah, anyways, like I was saying. And then and then we get, you know, we both get what we ordered or whatever. And it comes in and it hits the table and she looks at mine and she's like, Oh, you gonna give me a bite of that? No. I should have got what you got. <laughs> Not always. And I'm like, uh-huh. I know how to pick them, man. Sometimes. Alright, that that's <laughs> That's too much. Maybe maybe not all the time. Oh, look at that. <laughs> She's the one who got some on the sheets, not me. You want more of this one, That's okay. We probably need new pillowcases anyways. Man, I just want to keep eating this. I'm really surprised, guys. Uh, it's mm. yeah, she's, she's over here waiting for a bite and everything, <laughs> man. Uh... I, I came into this skeptical, too. Yours has a slightly better texture than this one. I think this one needs to thaw. Maybe that one got... A little more. ...thawed in the store or something. Mm-hmm. Because, because that one... Like, this almost... It's almost sandy. Did mm. you kind of get that a little bit? It's not all of it, but some of it. Oh, this one's really good, though. Mm -hmm. And uh, how much was this? I'm, I'm curious now. <laughs> well... You gotta keep in mind again, this is a small oh town store. She didn't just say it, so it's gonna be. <laughs> Am I gonna like not like it as soon as you tell me? It was six fifteen for each of them. <laughs> Come on, man. Yeah. Uh, it it tastes a little less good now, guys. <laughs> so we're so this is twelve dollars worth of ice cream. No, this is <laughs> this is thirteen dollars worth of ice cream right here. Well, for, can we afford this? <laughs> <laughs> for tonight, we can. That's why we're eating some first, and then we'll wow. share it with the kids. <laughs> so, are they hiding behind the keto name a little bit there? Mm hmm And uh, probably marking it up at the store. Two bucks, from what it's worth. Well. Yeah. I mean, I, I would probably pay like four bucks for this. Right, it's like the whole Ben and Jerry's type of thing where you get the small, fun flavor of ice Yeah, cream. but with that one, you're buying the name that's been around for like, what, 20 years? Mm, but this one says, Keto Certified. I can print that too. <laughs> I can make that in paint. <laughs> no, that doesn't mean much to me. I see a lot of lab tests and a lot of stuff all the time and... They all look like the same ones. It's just, uh, I don't know, but 
it does taste pretty good. So if you're on like a keto diet or something. So oh yeah, definitely. You're getting this kind of stuff. Well, then you probably already know about it and probably could teach us <laughs> some stuff about it. So maybe just leave it in the comments and let us know what's the deal. You all right? <laughs> She's going to make it. ice cream all over. Can't take her anywhere, man. You can't even leave the bedroom. She's all ready. Mm -hmm. No, you didn't get a peanut butter cup, though. That's a big old <laughs> hunk right there. You want that one. Yeah, get you a hunk. <laughs> I got one. For the first time in your life. No, it's all right. But yeah, I mean, look at that. Look at that texture, though. Impressive. Impressive for ice cream. That's. So what are they missing, though, in keto? Do they get to use all the same ingredients? They have the healthier, like the sugar alcohols. Oh, and no, the... no sugar added, I just saw. Right. You didn't know that? No, I didn't know that. <laughs> Was that what keto is? No, um, the whole less processed, no sugar, more, I think they do more fats and proteins. So monk fruit is pulling its weight oh. in this baby, man. No, nope, right. like low carbs. Oh yeah, sugar is basically carbs, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Oh, there's chicory root fiber in here. <laughs> what? You don't find that interesting? Not at all. A fiber in ice cream? I find it as interesting as uh, maybe figuring out what that stuff is one day. But what is chicory root? <laughs> <laughs> it's a good source of fiber. Yeah, she's gonna. She's gonna. Dude, yeah, this is yeah. Funny right tomorrow now. you're gonna get a whole paragraph. Yeah. Well, this is hilarious because like she's gonna try and sound real smart right now. I, but like up. I know she doesn't really have a clue about anything. It's a do. good source of fiber. Good source of fiber. That's what somebody says. With, Dietary fiber. So yeah. is grass, man. But you can't. Well, no, maybe not. That tastes good, obviously, right? No. It's like when she would come to me and say, remember those fiber? It's all natural. I said, give me five minutes in the bathroom and I'll have a whole handful of all natural. <laughs> Is that what you want? You want something all natural? Man, there's a lot of things that are all natural, man. That doesn't mean that is true. much. Like when we found out yeah, about natural no. flavoring. Nope. Don't even, don't even. We're man. not going to go there. I want to keep eating this. I mean, they get enough con conspiracies on the news and stuff. We're not doing that here in our bedroom, <laughs> in our bed. Come on, man. But I don't believe any children were conceived on this mattress, though, right? No. <laughs> no, so... Uh, not yet. <laughs> well, hey, man. Anyways. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's a camera there. How's it, how's it going, guys? How you doing? Uh, wow, I want to keep eating this. So, I think we did what we came here to do. Mm -hmm. I want to keep eating yours. We embarrassed ourselves. Yeah. We tested <laughs> out this, this ice cream, this keto cream. And uh, actually, I kind of think it tastes better with the less sugar like they did. Mm -hmm. I would like to see more ice creams like this, but maybe try to find a way to get some cheaper monk fruit so it doesn't have to be six fifty for this thing. <laughs> but hey, man, if you want to treat yourself, mm -hmm. this stuff is uh, pretty fantastic, I think. And yeah, no sugar, man. Wow. So yeah, that could be good for like maybe people with like a high glycemic index or... Uh, you know, struggle with diabetic issues, maybe that's like a sweet option for you, actually. Mm -hmm. You don't have to give up ice cream, even though it's hot. Summer's almost over. Hope you guys had a good one. I hope you guys are having a sweet night. Thank you for watching another one of these. <laughs> Thank you for coming out. Thank you for uh, all the good stuff and all the positive stuff. And hopefully, we catch you next time.